now at Mount of Olives and we are entered to see the ascension spot. But the ascension spot today, it's a mosque. Because the sun is in our eyes, we will talk about it soon. That we are already in the compound, which is now part of the mosque. And you can see so many things here. Uh, you already saw the most important part, the memorial site where Jesus ascended in heaven. You can see here, um, um, wall from the Muslim time, but from time to time you can see some remains from the Byzantine churches that were here. Then now we are inside the Ascension Church, and you asked me before, where is the Ascension spot? Then let me tell you, let me remind you that the, at the Byzantine, at the um, Crusader Church, the door was open. And the, and the Ascension happened just from here. But, for so many years, you could see here two, um, two parts like that, and according to what we believe, that is the left, the right, um, left of Jesus when he ascended. It was right here in the center, but the Muslims, when they built that chapel, they built it as a Muslim chapel. You can see the Mihrab. Mihrab, it actually tells you where the Muslims are praying, and Mecca is there. Then when the Muslims are using it, they are sitting here, and they move it to them. There were two uh, stones like that. We don't know what's happened to the other stone. It is clear, might be that pilgrims used to take some small pieces. Some other rulers said that it's in Rome, but we can actually blame Rome for everything. It's in Rome, where's the Ten Commands? Rome, where's the Ark? Rome, which I'm not sure that it's true. Some people believe that uh, the Muslims took it to uh, an Aqsa Mosque. We don't know, it doesn't matter. But it's important for me that everyone here will touch it and bless it. And again, I don't know if you're Catholic, Protestant, or whatever. This is maybe the most important stone of that all today. Then, who's going to be the first one? And I will take pictures of him.